My name is uh, Sid Feldman. I am an Associate Professor of Family and Community Medicine at the University of Toronto and I'm the Medical Director at uh, Baycrest Apotex Home for the Aged, uh, which is a 472 bed uh, nursing home and a community family doctor for 25 years. And uh, I think from my perspective as a uh, family doctor, the key thing that I would emphasize is um, when we have patients who have had with whom we've had relationships for many years, it might even be a decade, and they have that first fracture, what a game changer that can be. So the vibrant, uh, outgoing person who really may be old in years, but young in spirit, uh, all of a sudden becomes a changed person. And in front of us, we see this person in chronic pain. Uh, they may no longer be ambulatory. All of a sudden, their world has shrunk. And I guess for me, that, that's how I got into the whole world of osteoporosis and fracture prevention, realizing what a game changer uh, osteoporosis can be, and uh, deciding that we can make a difference, uh, that by identifying people who are at high risk, we can uh, treat them, and they get better. And they, the fracture is prevented, and, and uh, our, our, our patients continue to, to thrive. And I think in the nursing home in particular, when we have so many competing demands and so many active problems that we're dealing with, uh, it's hard to remember osteoporosis and fracture prevention because it hasn't happened yet. So uh, the, the question of uh, paying attention to something which is critically important but silent, uh, I, I suppose is the thing that I would want to highlight so that we look at each of our patients, assess their risk for fracture, and then uh, vigorously uh, treat them in an appropriate way uh, going forward.